What's going on, guys? Uh, been a couple days. I made a video, but uh, I can see it's night out. Or almost night. We got a breeze all day today. Um, we had a breeze. The wind blew all night last night, and the wind is blowing. The wind has been blowing. It never stopped blowing basically uh, since today is uh, Wednesday. Basically since Saturday, the wind has never stopped blowing. And uh, so that means when the wind blows, that means you can cut, you can cut, like, right? Well, we tried to cut yesterday morning at, uh, we tried to cut this morning at 7.30. I mean, 8.30, is now 6.30. We are 190 acres in for the day. Yeah, you know that right. Heck of a day. Uh, we have cut since Saturday. Today is Wednesday. Like I said, we have cut. We have, we have cut a, a pinch over 600 acres of beans. I mean, it's incredible. The weather we've had is incredible. And uh, we've got rain coming in on tomorrow night. And they're talking about rain for the next. Uh, well, they're talking about rain. We've been really dry. I haven't had any rain in a while. Miserable rain in a while. And, uh, like, I haven't had any measurable rain probably a month. Well, it's probably three weeks, we had like a half inch. But, in a couple, in a couple of weeks, we had, we had like a half inch rain. But, uh, until then, and since then, we haven't had any rain. And before that, and before that it was like uh, a month before that. So, we were really dry, and we really needed rain. But, we don't, we're about to get like four inches of rain, and it's going you know, to be crappy and cold. Like, right now, it's, it, was 80, it, was 80, it was 80 degrees today. Crappy and cold, and uh, it's going to get crappy. 80 degrees today, been nice all week, and breezy, um, and uh, it's going to get crappy. It's going to get crappy and cold uh, after tomorrow, the rain, and so we're down to six. We're down to like 140 acres when we get this going. We leave this field here done. We're down to 140 acres. So. Can we get down Fort Wayne? Well, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna try. We're gonna we're gonna try. These are double these are double crop beans. The real good beans, uh, making the mid fifties, which is really good for double crops. Um, I may have said that already, um, but uh, we're gonna give them. We're, we're trying our best to get them done. Because uh, two years ago, on the on the ready farm we're going to next finish up. We uh, we uh, ended up sitting right there picking some beans. Um, we had we had 11 acres, 12 acres left. It's 140 acre field, and um, we ended up uh, sitting there for a week and a half waiting on the. Waiting on, wait on to be dry enough to bend those 11 acres of beans. And it wasn't, it wasn't like, oh, we give me 18% beans and be done. It wasn't that. I mean, it literally didn't rain. It literally rained for a week and a half. So. Yeah. Say nothing. You gotta say the beans are going in there. You can't see. So yeah, beautiful sky tonight. Sunset's pretty. You want to have about the dirty windows.
Yeah. Uh, I mean, thank goodness for auto steel, right? You can't say nothing. But we got just a little bit. You got two passes left in this field, and we're going to call it a night. Probably be our trucks by the end too. Um, we're feeling last truck. What we're probably running into is every, all our bins are full, and uh, everybody's running so hard on beans. They're really good crop this year, beans. And uh, all the elevators are full. Everybody's beans are full, and the weather's been so uh, pretty that. The weather's been so the weather's been so pretty that uh, that uh, they haven't rained a lot. Uh, so no, no one no one stops harvesting, so they can't you know the granaries can't you know haul out and everything. And it's just been the, the local granary here in town. They've been open every day from they they've had a, they've only been open running like half days um, because you know they're full of beans and I don't know if they don't have. I don't know if I've ever seen that happen before. And then you got, uh, and then you got, uh, the Mississippi River is so low right now that, uh, that the Mississippi River is so low right now that, uh, you know, because it hasn't rained and it's dry all over. That's happened two years, that's happened two years in a row. So, Kind of interesting, uh, but I mean, I've been. I mean, our bins are full. We've stuffed every. We got every bin stuffed. Ain't been stuffed with stuff. And uh, oh, I think I know you're getting tough. Anyway, like I said, we have got every bin stuffed full. We can stuff full. We got uh, all of the intro corn. And we got one bean bin full, look on the second bean bin, and then when it gets full, it's like it might hold all these, but it's probably gonna be a couple loads short. But uh, we've been hauling to town in the day when we can, when they're open, and then when they're not open, we've been throwing them in the bin. Trying to keep enough room so we keep the charge progressing. But it's a good problem to have after last year, the crop was awful, and so it's, good, it's, a, good, it's a good year to have this. It's, it's, let's have a good year this year, so. Yeah. Anyway, not time harvesting. I, I, I always like cutting beans at night. Well, I, I always like running equipment at night. And I don't have to do anything at night. So yeah. 